My name is Rafa Jimenez. I'm the CTO and one of the co-founders of, of Handcash, a gaming wallet working on the BSB network. When you're building a new product, you want to make sure that you're building the right product and you want to know that as soon as possible. So ideally, you don't want to invest a year or six months trying to figure out how to even get started. And that's when Handcash comes very, very handy for them. We offer a product for developers, for game developers, a very nice suite of payments, game items, access to user accounts. And all of that works on top of the blockchain. But the most important thing for us is making everything very, very easy for them. And our target company, I would say, is they're not really, really, really into Web3. The companies who are starting to hear about blockchain, trying to understand the, the use cases, the competitive advantage that they can get, uh, so our job and our role is to bring the new, the new commerce to this technology, the games who still are trying to make the first steps into the, the blockchain direction. Game developers and, and game studios, they're very excited about this because they can offer an innovative way for their users to trade with the game items, uh, to create new experiences. And at the same time, they are still able to monetize that secondary market, getting some some royalties. So that is a very, very nice use case that fits very, very well with blockchain. The blockchain offers certain characteristics that are very, very beneficial for payments. In particular, instant transactions worldwide, low fees. And also another very interesting characteristic is the uh, NFTs, because that improves um, trust, a way of communicating over the internet, transferring game items um, and these characteristics work very well for, for the gaming industry and for the users because they really understand the value of, of blockchain in that aspect.